Giselle, no, you must not play with the super snow machine. You could freeze everything and turn the entire city to ice. Ha! Huh. I guess you aren't as dumb as you look, Santa. That's exactly what I'm gonna do. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. My name's Designer Slash Gamer, and today we're playing Lego Worlds. So, we've called an emergency town council meeting to try to figure out how we can fix Ivory City. If you guys saw the last episode, you saw that Giselle the Terrible used the super snow machine and she froze all of Ivory City in solid ice. I mean, it does look really cool. But it's slippery and it's crazy cold and if it stays like this then I don't know so we need to fix that so we've got mayor classic space guy here and he's thinking he's using his brain real hard and he's thinking about what we can do um hey Sheila you got any ideas for uh, for how we can fix this problem oh just a matter of getting some heat uh, okay well that's a good idea but it's the middle of winter. I wonder how we're going to get uh, get some heat around here. We need a lot of heat, you guys. Rex is here representing the dinosaurs from Jurassic World. He said he had a few good ideas, but uh, he, he's fallen asleep, so I don't know if we can get anything out of him right now. Oh, hey, Dr. Ferno. You're a diabolical genius. Do you have any ideas of how we could melt the ice in Ivory City? Oh, follow me? Okay. I guess we'll follow him. Oh. Can you let us through, Dynamite? She's guarding the door. Excuse me, Shania. You look lovely today. Uh, hey, Doc. How's it going? Yeah, okay, I guess that's a good idea. I mean, the missile would probably melt the ice, but it might do a little more damage than that, and we just really want to melt the ice, so... We need to think of a few other ways, but that's actually not a bad idea. You know, we could... Okay, well, he's, he's headed out. Um, oh, hey, other classic space guy. Hey, do you have any ideas for how we could melt the ice? Make it summer? Well, it's a really good idea, but I don't think we can do that. It's going to be winter for a while. <laughs> They're just going to bounce. <laughs> oh, there's the Yeti. How's it going, Yeti? Hey, do you have any ideas on how we could melt the city? Oh, it's perfectly fine the way it is? Well, yeah, I'm sure you like it. Oh! Rude! I don't think we're gonna get any help from the Yeti, classic space guy. In fact, we should kind of back away. Oh, let's get that blue crystal. Whew, we don't want to lose one of those. Well, guys, it's just about to be morning time, and Ivory City is beautiful, because it's Ivory City. It's all icy and pretty. We could leave it this way. But we probably should melt it. So let's stop eating donuts and cookies. And let's figure this out. So we got Rex over here. Rex agreed to help. I think he's sleeping though. Of course Sheila's here. Hey Sheila. You dealing with Rex? Hey Sheila, do you think Rex might have a plan on how we can thaw off the city? You do? Okay, well let's wake him up. Rex? Oh look, there's Wildstyle. Hey Wildstyle! Uh oh, she's mad. Sorry. Oh. 
All your DJ equipment got frozen. Sorry about that. You'll be back to DJing in no time. Let's see, Rex? Rex? Wake up, buddy. Oh, okay. Well, that's a good way to wake him up, but that didn't end too well. Uh, let's go over here, classic space guy. Well, at least you got an apple out of it. Um, Rex? Hey, buddy. Hey, so... Apparently you have a plan on how we can thaw all this ice out in Ivory City and return it to normal? That's what everyone's saying anyway. What's that? You and the other dinosaurs in Jurassic World are willing to help us out? Rex, that's incredible! Well, what are you gonna do? You're gonna make Mount Saibo erupt? Huh. Well, I guess that would work. I mean... That would create a lot of heat. A volcanic eruption would probably definitely melt all the ice. Oh, Rex, it's a great idea. I'm sure, it, oh, okay, well, he's in a bad mood, clearly. Classic space guy, what are you doing with that snowball? Uh, I don't think Rex wants to have a snowball fight with you. It's not the best idea, buddy. <sighs> what did I tell you? Sheila would have never done that. She knows better. Hey, Sheila, you don't mind if I hang out with Classic Space Guy today, do ya? He is the mayor of Ivory City. And we gotta make some deals, we gotta get some stuff done, because we have to thaw this frozen city. So I'm just gonna hang out with him for today, okay? Don't worry, we will get all of this... Who are you talking to, buddy? <laughs> we will get all of this fixed. Rex promised to help us out, so we're gonna head over to Jurassic World. No, it's okay, Classic Space Guy. Don't worry, it's gonna be fine. You'll be okay. You're mayor. Yeah, and you're doing a great job. I mean, the city is frozen solid. But, but you're doing well. Actually, you're not doing well. You're doing terrible. But you know what? We can fix it. Yes, it's all fixable. Looks like she was too busy. Alright, let's get out of here. Alright, Classic Space Guy. Let's get out of here before Rex gets us. Oh. Hey, Sheila, what are you doing? <laughs> she's a paleontologist, so she knows what she's doing. But we better get out of here before we become Rex's breakfast. Okay, let's jump down. Ready? Ready, classic space guy? <sighs> it's an icy world, but it's pretty down there. Okay, ready? Jump! Oh my gosh. It's so pretty. You know, you guys, I would leave it like this, because it is really cool. <laughs> it's cool, I get it, it's cold. Um, but Ivory City was cool just the way it was. So we gotta fix it. But you know, there's no harm in doing a little exploring. Are you just like sliding down that? Look at that, that's so cool. <laughs> it's just sliding down. <laughs> it's very slippery. Okay, let's go down here. So apparently Santa left his sleigh down here for us, because he knew we would need a way to get to Jurassic World. And what better way to fly to Jurassic World than in Santa's sleigh, right? So icy, with the fire department completely frozen solid. And yet the firemen and firewomen are out here. They're still working. They certainly are troopers. Keep up the good work, fire people. You guys are great. You guys, look, it's a penguin. Hey, little buddy, how's it going? Look at him waddling around. <laughs> so there is one benefit to having a frozen solid city. And that's that there's penguins running around. Come here, buddy. Come here, let me give you a fish. Let me give you a fish. <laughs> oh my gosh, this guy is so cute. Hi, hi, hi. <laughs> Do you want to come with us to Jurassic World? I'm sure the dinosaurs will like you a lot, yeah? <laughs> What's that, buddy? No, the dinosaurs in Jurassic World won't eat you. Oh my gosh, that's cute. No, they don't eat penguins. Can you swim? We can pick him up. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I didn't know we could pick up penguins. That's so cute. So Santa left his sleigh here for us, and it's right over here. So I think we should hop in the sleigh and go to Jurassic World. Hi, reindeer. How you guys doing? Merry Christmas. Okay, let's hop in the sleigh. I wonder if we can keep our penguin with us. There we go, buddy. Okay, stay in the seat there. We're heading to Jurassic World. It's okay, you're gonna be just fine. Everybody ready? Oh, our penguin already fell asleep. <laughs> okay, here we go, guys. Heading to Jurassic World. Yeah. 
Yes! Oh! Penguin! Okay, well, I guess he'll walk to Jurassic World. <laughs> Okay guys, here we are, Jurassic World! Looks like Giselle hasn't gotten to this yet. It's a good thing too, dinos don't really like the cold. Okay. Here's the T-Rex Kingdom, let's go ahead and land over here somewhere. Let's see, right about here. Uh, Classic Space Guy, do you know how to land a sleigh? I mean, we have to land right in here, right by the dinosaurs, and the troll. Maybe don't land on top of the troll's head? Well, okay, that's fine. All right, classic space guy. Let's put your negotiating skills to the test. We have to convince these dinosaurs to help us out. Uh, hey, Rex? Hey, I know you're pretty busy in the fight with that other Rex there, but uh, here's the thing. Ivory City got frozen with a bunch of ice and we need to melt it. So, do you guys mind helping us destroy the volcanic laboratory so we can trigger a volcanic eruption and melt the ice? Oh. Should we take that as a yes? That's probably a yes, right? What do you think, Rex? How do you feel about that? You wouldn't want Christmas to be ruined, would you? Those teeth look pretty sharp. Oh, okay. Uh, maybe we should go over here. Oh, okay. Oh, hey, Sheila, how's it going? Have you convinced any of these dinosaurs yet to join the fight? Because we're going to need some help here. Oh, I know. It's kind of funny. Well, you know, I have an idea. How about we just knock down one of these walls? And maybe then... Oh, look at that. Sheila's already getting on one. Okay, Sheila, we'll follow your lead. Here's what we'll do, Classic Space Guy. We're going to use the big bomb, and we're going to blow a hole in the wall here so that these guys can get out. All right, how about right here? Don't worry, you guys, we will fix this. We'll fix this, but right now it's more important that we melt the ice in Ivory City. Okay, so let's see, we just gotta aim this, and we'll throw it right there. Oh, yes, that's perfect. I'm sure a T-Rex can get through that, right? Hey, buddy, come over here. Let's do another one just in case. Yeah, oh yeah, now we got plenty of room. Maybe just uh, for good measure, let's do this side too. There we go. Okay, maybe a little more right here. Perfect. Okay, ooh, yeah. Well, maybe another one here. Look at this Rex. He's like, what are you doing? We're supposed to stay in here. No, you're supposed to get out and go to the volcano. Maybe this one too. We just want to make sure there's a plenty of space for these guys to get out of here. And this one too. There we go. And don't worry, guys. We'll fix all this. We got this. Okay, let's put that away. Sheila, you can try it again. Here, let's try it. Come here, Rex. Come here, buddy. There we go. Let's just hop on him here. Come here, buddy. There we go. Okay. This way, buddy. I know how badly you've been wanting to get out of here, and now is your chance. <laughs> Dino escape! Yes! Let's head over. Watch out, people. Watch out. Rex! Well, I guess we should have saw that coming. <laughs> I guess dinos will be dinos, right? All right, let's head over to the volcanic laboratory and let's trigger the biggest volcanic eruption Ivory City and Jurassic World have ever seen. Look at Mount Saibo. So we've worked very hard to get it to not erupt, but now we're gonna make it erupt. And all we have to do is destroy the laboratory. Don't worry, we'll fix it. But that way, Mount Saibo will erupt and it'll melt all that ice in Ivory City. Okay, Rex, let's do this.
Hey, Sheila, you think that's gonna melt all the ice in Ivory City? You don't? Uh-oh. I think it's gonna work, you guys. I mean, that is gonna be a lot of heat generated from that volcano. Well, only one way to find out. Let's go to Ivory City and see if all that ice is melted. All right, guys, here we are, coming up on Ivory City. Oh. Oh, I don't see that much ice. Oh my gosh, you guys, I think all the ice is melted and everything's back to normal. Yay, look at this. Oh, Ivory City's so beautiful. Yay. Christmas isn't canceled, yay. Well, we wouldn't have canceled it anyway because you can't cancel Christmas, right? <laughs> oh, this is great, it's back to normal, woohoo. Looks like Chinatown's back to normal. The Eiffel Tower is back to normal. The church is back to normal. Good thing too, can you imagine how long that would take to rebuild all of that? <sighs> all right guys, it is Christmas Eve, so we're gonna head down to the giant snowman and we're going to have a gift exchange and a party with all of our friends from Ivory City. Okay, classic space guy, try to land the sleigh gently, gently, right there. Oh man, that was a perfect landing. How about we get out a carrot for the reindeer? Oh yeah, come here reindeer. You guys did so good. Here's a little snack for you. Merry Christmas everybody. We are here in the giant snowman in Ivory City and we're celebrating Christmas with all of our friends and family because there's no better place to be on Christmas than with friends and family. Looks like Sheila's boyfriend is back here, Agent Chase. Hey buddy, how's it going? I bet you guys wish there was a giant mistletoe in here, don't you? But instead there's a giant snowflake. But you guys could pretend it's a mistletoe, couldn't you? <laughs> now that Ivory City is totally back to normal, Santa's gonna come visit tonight, he's gonna drop off some presents, he's gonna fill up our stockings, and we're going to have an incredible time with all of our friends. I hope you guys have a wonderful Christmas. Thank you so much for watching the episode. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and have a very Merry Christmas. And I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.